What's going on, everybody? I'm Eric Devante, and you're watching MajorFilmEvents.com. Tonight, we are at the Ohm Nightclub for the Dances with Film Film Festival, and I'm so excited to meet some creators, get inspired, and talk about great films. So what, what film are you guys here representing? Dini Bean is Dead. Dini Bean is Dead. Please tell me about Dini Bean and why they may be dead. I'll refer you to the writer. Dini Bean is Dead is a dark comedy with romance. It's about a woman who tries to win back her ex-boyfriend at his engagement party without revealing that her boss's dead body is in the trunk of her car in the front drive. I mean, that is a mood killer, I imagine. Uh, yeah, I think so, yeah. So what was your inspiration behind writing this film? Uh, I wanted to write a project that really uh, allowed a woman to be fully self-expressed, even through dark emotions like jealousy and grief. I wanted to see that, you know, that woman on screen. Okay, did it pull anything out of your emotions to write this? Because a woman scorned, you're the woman with the pen. Did it, did it take anything out of you? Uh, it was, um, it was wonderful. Actually, I would say it was a. It was an emotional closure for me after a difficult period of time. Now let me ask you, what is it that you guys are hoping for people to leave with once they see the film? Um, I hope to uh, sort of instill a little bit of uh, that human awkwardness, because that's part of our human story, you know, make that more tangible and relatable. I couldn't hide my awkwardness if I wanted to. Can you tell me a bit about um, the process of creating this film, bringing it to life? Well, I mean, Allison came with the script to me, so I was the director and Allison brought the script and we just went ahead, ahead and made the film, basically, with no money and just shot a film with relatively little money um, on the spur of the moment, if that's how you say it. Yeah. That's incredible. Kudos to you guys. Uh, where can we find you on social media so we can keep up with you and the film? DeaniBeanIsDead.com and we're also on Facebook, facebook.com forward slash Deanie Bean is dead. Indeed. <laughs> <laughs> great. Thank you so much. It was great meeting you. What film are you representing? Uh, Eagle Feather. What's that about? Uh, it's American Indian animated family friendly film and it's, uh, it's about, we took a bunch of stories that we'd all heard growing up when we were kids and connected them and changed them enough to make one big feature film and so we're uh, and then we used all Native American ceremonial music for the backgrounds and and then we you know that just connected it all together and when we found out remember Eagle that this film festival was coming up we cut a 15 minute short out of it so we could get in because we like this film festival yeah because it's fun because we were here last year they were the first film festival we ever got into and with our four minute version of it and then it played all over the world and so we made a feature out of it so incredible yeah. so what was it about these stories that made you feel the world needs to hear them. Uh, it's just that nobody, even most American Indians don't know any of this stuff anymore. It, it goes into like a lot of uh, traditional lore and shamanism and they, it was a real story but they're out finding a guy that's killing eagles out in Oregon and they're trying to figure out who's doing it, how and why and then so they're out doing that but it's then fa we want to make it family friendly so kids could watch it too so we even have like an 1830s this is my favorite story of them all but an 1830s story where the kid follows a war party out to go get his that's going to get his kidnapped friend back from another tribe but then we cut out all the scalping and and, and killing and, and just turn kid it friendly family friendly turn it family friendly no violence at all yeah yeah <laughs> that's great so can i have your social media so i can keep up with you guys in this film yeah, uh, and we're at uh, thundereagleproductions.com, and, and uh, so we have a website there, and then uh, we have a few of our movies are up on Amazon Prime now and stuff, and then we have our own animation team. We started to make our movies in Thailand, and so that's why we have all the Thai stuff on. Yeah, and then we were in Thailand uh, working on the on Eagle Feather, like because it's a feature film, and we found out we were in here, so we flew back to come yeah, hang out. <laughs> Congratulations, guys. Welcome back. Welcome back. <laughs> hey, everyone. Eric Devante signing off. I had a great time at the Dances with Film, Filmmakers Film Festival. It's an incredible experience every time I'm able to talk to bold, daring creators. And that's what's so unique about our film industry, the creative that goes behind it. Make sure you stay tuned to major film events. You never know where we'll be next.